somebody who has truly something that works, something that's successful, how do we differentiate and not be influenced by the materialism or try not to be influenced? How do we know if it's genuine or not? You got to do your due diligence. You got to what do you mean? What, well, that's, a great, that's a great answer. Give me specifics now though. What do you mean by due diligence? Uh, you, go to, uh, you go to YouTube, you go to a web page, you see somebody by their showing off their bling, a bling bling, all their fancy things and everything and say, oh wow, I wanna do what they're doing. I wanna have what they're having. How do you know they're genuine? Well, if, you're a if you're a wholesaler, let me let me see let me see your your HUDs. Let me see what you you know. Let me see your 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 documentation. And if they're really trying to teach you something, okay. Role play, role play with me, okay. You saw I'm I'm I, I'm go ahead. You saw all this stuff. You've called me up. You want to do business with me, but there's a credibility issue. Show me how you as a as a genuine, intelligent, and prospect would uh, would um, would determine whether I'm full of it or not. Hey, you know, Claude, um, you know, I really like what you're selling there. Um, you know, I think that that program would be something that I'm, uh, I'm interested in, in purchasing. Is there anything that you can show me anything, any deals that you'd be able to, to, um, to present to me so that I can, you know, kind of I, verify love, anything I, you're saying? I love that you asked me that question, Mr. Mr. Nadequi. Uh, that is fantastic. I wish more people would ask me questions like that and not just take it for granted. I really love that you asked me that. What would you need in order for us uh, to make you feel comfortable about my veracity, my credibility, and for us to move forward and make a commitment today? What would are you there, need from me, sir? Are, are there any transactions that you might have that, you know, would be that are verified from any third parties or anything that any documentation that you might have um, that, that you feel comfortable with sharing with me um, so that I can just kind of bear Like if you, like you own a few houses or a few, um, uh, would um, you like to see, uh, I, I, I'll, uh, whatever you need, sir. The only thing I ask in return mm -hmm. reciprocity mm -hmm. is that if, if these meet with your personal satisfaction, can we make a commitment to move forward and do business today? Absolutely. absolutely. I'm sorry. What? I'm sorry. What? Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay, great. So would you like to see deeds, paperwork? Would you like to speak to people I've done de deals with? That, that, have, that you gone, have you gone to my webpage and seen the live video testimonials I have? Um, I have seen the testimonials. Um, to be honest with you, I'm a little bit more skeptical with testimonials, but deeds would be perfect. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Oh, uh, uh, so how many people would you like to speak to? Three, four, five, 50? Three I think th three would be good for me. I'm going to send you five people today. I'm going to send you my friend, Damon Boudreaux. I, I think he, uh, we just recently did a transaction. Uh, he's in Louisiana. I can send you, I'll send you four other people and you speak with them and we'll talk again on Zoom if I have your word as a gentleman at 4.30 on Zoom and we'll, you'll either say, Claude, get lost, you're fired or we can move forward because it met with your needs. Is that fair? That's fair, Claude. That would okay, that was a good, that, give him a round of applause. That was a good role play. That's exactly what it should sound like. What did you guys, give me some takeaways. What did you learn from that? Somebody unmute yourself and speak. <laughs> 